the city of Chicago, a world-class city defined by its people. We'll take you around town and show you why the second city is second to none. 24-7 Chicago, revealing the secrets of the city, one Chicago and at a time. It was a night of glamour as we hung out at the Michigan Avenue Magazine lunch party. I heard my girl Michelle Williams from Destiny Child was there. Oh yeah, she's gorgeous. Check it out. I miss <laughs> It's the Michigan Avenue Magazine Launch Party, Chicago. This exclusive soiree was held in the heart of downtown at the swanky The James Hotel. And everyone was there, from Chicago's own supermodel Cindy Crawford to star actor Terrence Howard, top chef Stephanie Eisard, to Chicago's own Destiny's Child, Michelle Williams, even Minnie Mae, Vern Troyer made an appearance. And of course, I was there too. Michigan Avenue is a brand new magazine celebrating the people and the places that make Chicago one of the greatest cities in the world. And as I mingled with the stars, I was amazed to find out that all of us had Midwestern roots. We were born in Chicago. Born in Chicago. Born in Jordan, Cook County Hospital. I really wanted to get one of those bricks from that hospital and put it as uh, one of the foundation stones for my house in Philly. I, I guess Midwestern, a couple years after you left, and the boys in tech were still like Crawford yeah, went here. I was like the tech lady, right? Yeah. Famous girl tech lady. I was like one of the few girls in tech there, yeah. I was born in Evanston, actually. Okay, and so now why are you back in Chicago? You live here full time now? I do. I moved back here about nine years ago. I came out to visit some friends, and I just never went back. Yeah. She knows about Cherryville Mall. Oh my God. Well, I grew up in Michigan, and, you know, I'm a Midwest kid, and coming to Chicago, it's, um, I don't know, it almost feels like family. I have to tell you, I feel kind of, like, so beautiful. Like, like, what do you wear with Cindy Crawford? <laughs> and why do the stars think Chicago should win the bid for the 2016 Olympics? To the committee, I mean, what better city could you ask for? We just have such a diverse and great culture, and with the lake there and everything, it's perfect. It's all about the people, because I would say it's a, it's a small town with a lot of people. So they have your pizza. Chicago is the greatest city on earth. Well, in my opinion, it's the best city in the world. I wouldn't pick any other place. Yeah. Chicago carries its own nostalgia to it. You know, it has a historicity that cannot be denied. Hi, this is Vern Choi. Hi, this is Terrence Howard. Hi, I'm Cindy Crawford, and you're watching 24-7 Chicago. I love you. Bob Jordan, a WGN news anchor for over 30 years in this fair city, has become a fixture in Chicago hearts. And 24-7 Chicago had a chance to go one-on-one -on -one with Bob. Check it out. This is WGN Morning News at 7. <laughs> Hello. Hi, I wanted to find out the other morning you showed um, a little clip of a magazine that Robin Baumgarten had an article in about herself and Cindy Crawford was on the cover. <laughs> I put just it wanted in to know what magazine that was. I couldn't remember. Yeah, there it is, Robin. Michigan Avenue Magazine. The lovely uh, Susanna mm -hmm. Holman, fiance of our own Tom Negevin, yep. the new editor-in-chief there. Brand and new magazine. That brand new debut magazine. issue they put Debut you issue. Wow. And look who's on the front. The front woman wow. featured, Larry. Wow. And notice Cindy Crawford and I posing exactly the same uh -huh. way. Uh -huh. That's not a coincidence. Not a coincidence. Right. Michigan Avenue Magazine. Yes. On October 1st, it's on a new stand. Yeah. Uh -huh. I thought it was on hey, let's stands. get to that okay, next. Uh, I think it's on stands now, isn't it? Uh, uh, who knows? There's an email from Jonas. Hey, guys.